What's up guys, Lion Life here, and welcome back to another Brown Dust 2 video. So if you haven't seen it already, we just got the new character story pack, which is revealed to be called Exodus, which is gonna be featuring Grey as a manager, Elianir, Seer, and Helena, B-rank Helena, as an idol group. So we're gonna be taking a look at the two new PVs that they drop, and then I'll kind of be going over my thoughts and feelings about them afterwards. All right, so the first video they put out, it looks like it's just a general showcase of the of character pack for Exodus, so let's look at that. Yo, she fell on top of Gray. He's probably, I can die happy now. Okay. So I'm assuming we're only gonna be getting two brand new costumes for the characters. It, they only gave out two new PVs, but we'll go over some more information about that afterwards and we'll see what happens. All right, so this one's gonna be starting off with B-Rank Idol, Elenir. Bro. The <laughs> they need to be stopped. I can't even hit it on time. I'm, I'm in such shock. They need to be stopped. <laughs> Yo. You know, if there's one thing about the Brown Dust 2 dev team, they gonna give you fan service. I mean, she looks good. The art is nice. Hey, she's cute, though. I like this background track. Yo, she threw a rabbit. I guess the rabbit she carries with her, she just tossed that. And then this one's gonna be the PB for Helena specifically. I love this showcase for them. That's really cute. I like that. Ooh, nice. Little booty shake. I appreciate it. <laughs> Helena's fucking adorable, bro. I love Helena. The, you know, the art is never, bro. The art always is good for Brown Dust right now. They do a really good job. Okay, so hold up. So she's got, rev okay, so her skill is revival again. And then it looks like Seer is going to be stealth. So I like Elenir in this type of vibe, in this form for her. They Again, they definitely do it right with the with the fan service for her. Very, very nice. Love to see it. Um, I think she looks really great. I like this is going to be a second costume for her, so that's good. Um, it's different. It's not what she normally has. It looks like her skills seem to involve throwing that rabbit attack, which we see here um, in the combat preview for her. She's throwing the bunny as like her ult, right? She tosses at the enemy. She hits them three times, and she gives some kind of debuff. It looked like it was silence. I think that's what it was. So, I mean, man, it's not too bad. Is it something that I think I want to pull for? Probably not. Maybe not. I think... <laughs> I just realized she's, like, holding herself up. <laughs> she's pulling up her fucking shirt. Anyway, while I like Helena, y'all know I love her, but it doesn't feel different. It doesn't look different, right? It's just B rank Helena. Now, maybe in the future they might do like a trainee idol or idol trainee Helena. I don't know. Maybe they're going to give her like the steps or the tiers for different versions of her. Um, and maybe if they all do something different, maybe that'll determine whether or not they're worth pulling for or worth going for. Who knows? Um, overall, though, it relatively just looks and kind of feels like it's the same character. But I'm assuming symbol wise, it looks like she's healing and it looks like she also increases crit rate given what the symbol looks like. So I will say probably overall, I really like the idea of this. I think it's a really cute story pack. I think it's gonna be really, really funny. I think we're gonna have some really good moments within it. The idea of Gray being like a manager for an idol group just sounds like it's gonna be pretty hectic and really funny. Um, he probably can get hit a couple times as we probably saw in a couple bits um, <laughs> in, in the uh, uh, trailers as well. So, it, so we're gonna have that comedy and that uh, really, really funny moments inside of the story pack, which I, we can expect, right? Now the characters I really don't know about. Um, um, until we get to see more about the details of what their kits are specifically um i don't know if i'm gonna pull for that it depends we'll see right now it's a big meh only because elian um elanir didn't seem to really do much besides a three hit chain and silence like i can get if anything the big i guess the big bonus of that is the silence and like if you're working on a chaining team sure maybe she might, she might work for that but i feel like i'd much rather have silence through other other means with other characters um and then helena doesn't look and or feel that different pretty much not at all um from what i'm able to see here so it doesn't look like helena's gonna be worth much 
either, which really sucks to say, because y'all know I love Helena. That's my girl. That's who I started with when I started the game, and I really like her, and I like her design, I like her character, uh, just her overall vibe and characteristics, right? Uh, let me know what you guys think down below. Do you like the characters? Are you gonna pull them, or are you not gonna pull for them? Maybe we'll get some other costumes for Grey and Seer, maybe not through a gotcha pull, maybe for free, who knows? That'd be nice to get a, a little free costume, why not? Um, but we'll see what happens once when the update goes live, or once we get the patch notes before the updates, so maybe we can go over those in the meantime. But that's it for me, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Y'all have a good one. Bye.